watching Let's Chat. Airing this Sunday on News 12 Now is the Tennessee Sports Hall of Fame Class of 2020 special presented by the Tennessee Titans. Here to tell us what that is, give us a preview of the inductees and honorees for the 2020 season and how we can participate in a silent auction and get some great items is Mr. Brad Willis. Good morning, Brad. Good morning. Good to see you. All right. Tell us a little bit about the Tennessee Sports Hall of Fame. I'm a sports person, so I'm familiar, but maybe not everybody is. So we are a, a, a 501c3 nonprofit based in Nashville, Tennessee. The, the hall itself was founded in 1966 by a group of sports writers meeting at a Holiday Inn in Manchester, Tennessee, who decided that they should uh, kind of put their efforts together and, and honor uh, sports figures from across the state. It was actually uh, not uh, put into charter until, I want to say, 1994. And then the Tennessee Sports Hall of Fame Museum was built in Bridgestone Arena in 2000. And we have a 7,700 square foot museum, really right at the epicenter of tourism in downtown Nashville at Bridgestone Arena, uh, which is open Tuesday through Saturday from 10 to 4 every day. And uh, we just encourage people to come in, check it out. You're going to learn about your favorite players. You're going to learn about your favorite teams. And you'll probably learn about some folks you've never heard about before that have made great impact on sports in the state of Tennessee. Mm -hmm. It's a great place to visit, whether you're a real sports person or not. There really is something for everyone to see. Um, and I want to talk about 2020. Of course, it's been a different year, and you've had to adjust a little bit from what would normally be the typical ce celebration uh, for this year's inductees and honorees. Tell us how things are a little different. They are quite a bit different, in fact, because I, I took over in this position in January. We went around uh, alerting our inductees that they were going to the Tennessee Sports Hall of Fame, and then we got to March, and the world stopped. And so we held out hope that we would get to June or July and we'd still be able to hold a banquet because the great thing about going into a Hall of Fame like this is, is it's much of a celebration of your supporters and the people around you as it is your accomplishments. And so we all, we, our biggest fundraiser of the year is our banquet. And of course, we got to the point where we simply decided, you know what? This is not going to be in the in the best health for health and well-being of everybody involved. And we didn't want to put our inductees in a situation where they felt compelled to be a part of something that maybe they weren't comfortable with. So we pivoted our strategy again because it's the biggest fundraiser of the year. Uh, we wanted to do something different and try to still honor this class. And so what you're going to see Sunday at noon on, on News 12 now is a special that's going to spotlight the, the entire class, all 11 inductees and our honorees, uh, which includes Dolly Parton. Uh, we get a lot of questions about Miss Dolly, and uh, you know she's our Tennessean of the year, and we're really excited to have her as part of that. But it, the, the the special is going to uh, air this Sunday at noon, and in the meantime, you can also log on to our website and find out how you can help support the hall. Because again, we're a nonprofit 501c3 that's based here in Nashville that really exists based on the the support of people like you. Absolutely, and I want to dive into how we can support that um, between now and over the next couple of days. Now, this is going to be a nice silent auction. I was looking at some of the prizes earlier this morning. Um, I know I'm going to place a couple bids. Why don't you give us a preview without giving everything away? <laughs> Absolutely. So you can go to our website, which is tshf.net, and you can click on the link for the silent auction. All the proceeds from that auction are going to go to further our mission with the Tennessee Sports Hall of Fame. You're going to find autographed footballs, people like Derrick Henry and Jeff Fisher. You're going to find autographed baseballs from uh, from baseball players like Dansby Swanson, Tim Corbin, Coach Corbin, who's going into the hall this year. You're even going to be able to, to bid on a, a University of Tennessee helmet that's autographed and personalized to the winner from Peyton Manning. So a lot of great items, nearly 100 items in there to pick from. And again, that auction is up through 9 o'clock Sunday night. Mm -hmm. You can log on. Again, it's tshf.net, and you can bid. The collectors will really enjoy it, and they'll know that the proceeds are going to a great cause. Absolutely. This is the perfect opportunity for a collector, whether to add to your personal collection or, hey, Christmas is coming up. It's not too early to That's shop, right? right? <laughs> That's exactly right. All right. You gave us a little bit of a preview of some of the inductees. Of course, some great names that we know in Tennessee sports. And then again, you mentioned people just like Dolly who are champions of the state as well. Um, so this is going to be a two-hour television special airing right here on News 12 Now starting noon on Sunday. In the meantime, if we want any information, what's the best way to do so? You can check us out on our website. We're at tshf.net. You can follow us on social media. We're on Facebook at TN Sports Hall of Fame and on Twitter at the TSHF. We appreciate any support anybody can offer. Check us out. I think you'll, uh, if you get the chance to come to Nashville and take the tour of the hall, 
you'll really enjoy it. And then tune in Sunday because this class is, is really uh, noteworthy from top to bottom and we think you'll learn a lot about it. Absolutely. I'm looking forward to watching the special and getting out to see. Uh, it's been a couple years since I've visited the hall, so I'm excited to see it again. All right, Brad. Come to Nashville and see you. Thanks so much for joining us this morning. I know we will talk to you again soon. In the meantime, everyone, make sure to set your calendar, set your reminder, set your DVR for noon on Sunday right here on News Now.